your certified most accurate forecast from WMBF First Alert Meteorologist Andrew Dockery. And of course, you will find us here at the Marsh Walk. What a beautiful sunrise we have as you're looking at that sun coming up here over Myrtle's Inlet. This is where you'll be able to find us later today from four to seven hurricane week. Day three continues. And of course, as that sun comes up, we hope you We'll find the energy to come out this afternoon. You'll have to get a couple of showers and storms in the area, and we'll walk you through that. I still think we will be okay, and we have an indoor plan if need to later on. Let's go ahead and show you how all this pans out. First off, a beautiful view, not only in Merle's Inlet, but also in Coastal Carolina and Conway. You'll notice that sun is shining, clear skies around the area. A few clouds out there, but temperatures sitting at 70 degrees. 70 in North Myrtle Beach, 68 in Conway, 64 in Lumberton. Florence, you're sitting at 66 and Aner, 64 degrees. The 12-hour planner, it's a warm day with increasing storms late. Rain chances at 40%, and we'll hold on to those temperatures sitting in the mid-80s here. For today. So if you're further inland, it's not going to be too much warmer, only into the upper 80s with the rain chances at 40% from time to time, especially Conway, Florence, and Lumberton. Uh, we were talking about that severe weather risk. Good news is it's further to the southwest today, but a strong storm or two can't be ruled out as we head into this afternoon. Notice for the first half of the day, no worries, no issues. It says we go into the evening where a couple of those pop-up showers and storms will develop, and we do it all over again for your Thursday as well. In fact, Thursday afternoon, a passing shower or storm will be possible, and then by Friday, we begin to dry out and look at a calmer forecast to end the work week. Of course, here's a look at the forecast through the weekend. Temperatures 83 degrees on Thursday, 90 degrees for the inland areas, and those 90s sticking around Friday and Saturday, 92 degrees on Friday, 92 for Saturday, and then for Father's Day, warming up into the mid 80s for those beaches, mid 90s for your Sunday, with rain chances once again at 30%. Uh, will we ever get a break from the humidity? Not so much. In fact, most of it is humid at Simi. If we're going to get any sort of break, it would be this morning. It probably feels a little bit cooler to you. And then also at times Saturday morning before we'll start to see that humidity ramp up as we go into the forecast here for Saturday and then changing it into Sunday back to a steamy pattern.